And now just a quick word about the relative stability of alkanes. Each of these compounds has the chemical formula C8H18. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So this is just octane. This is two, five, dimethyl hexane. And this is two, two, three, three, tetramethyl butane. All of them are C8H18. These are the standard molar enthalpies of combustion. When you burn the straight chain compound, you get 5,470 kilojoules per, mol per mole. Turning two of these terminal groups into methyl groups, branching it a little bit, takes away 10 kilojoules per mole. It makes the compound more stable. And if we branch it further, we lose 8 kilojoules per mole. So the least branched is the least stable. The most branched is the most stable. So incidentally, when you're buying premium gasoline, you're trying to buy gasoline that has iso-octane. Which actually has that structure. It is two, two, four trimethylpentane doesn't have as much energy as the straight chain octane does. So you might think, why spend more money to buy fuel that contains less energy? Well, the reason is this ignites at just the right temperature and pressure and gives you finer control over the timing in your engine.